Hi, I'm Ari. Today I'm going to show you how to perform a contact travel measurement on an independent pole-operated high-voltage circuit breaker. Closing the breaker and open the breaker. For this breaker, we need to adapt the adapter screw due to the lack of space. So what we are using is we are shortening the tooth shaft so that we have space for mounting the transducer on it. We are starting to release the screw that is holding the lever. So the screw is gone and we have a washer. That is important that you keep the washer when you are mounting the screw adapter. When we have tightened it, and now it's time to place the transducer to the screw adapter. Here it's important to check that the lever never will hit the flexible arm. Fixed it. Checked that it's reached. And now it's time to mount the cable to the CBTN3. We are using the channel 1 on the CPTN3. We have a red dot on the TN3 and the red dot on the end of the cable. We are putting them together and pulling in the cable. Now it's time to connect the CPTN3 to the Sibano 500. The breaker is open, so we are starting to close the breaker. And after this, we are opening the breaker. Now the measurement is done and we can assess uh, the travel curves with total travel, speed and the damping distance. When you are mounting uh, back the screw, follow the instructions from the manufacturer, use uh, glue. and the wrench to tighten it correctly.